would have come back and helped them, and helped them out the situation they find themselves in. So uh, I was only, only too glad that uh, to assist. So as I said, it's just the end of the season. So hopefully we can get a wee bit of confidence back in, back in the squad and we can uh, start picking up a few results. And uh, you've obviously been watching the games this year. Uh, you, you know, you'd be familiar with players like Ross and Pete having managed him before and coming up with like against like Curtis Allen, uh, Callum Burnies. Would you say it would be a bit fair, fair to say that you'd be unfamiliar with a, a lot of the players, given that they've came back from across the water and they're a very young and inexperienced team? Yeah, that's for that's for a comment. As you said, uh, uh, and Ross and Peter poor down, managed Curtis at no, 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 only twenty three side, and obviously like said. Callum Burney, Willie Garrett, and knows him those boys, I know those boys, but there's a lot of them that, I, that I don't know. So I've got a uh, so say I'm out and see what uh, how madly strong they are and, or, or whatever. So we'll do it over the next few weeks. And what have you thought of the games that you've watched this year? I think they should. Uh, I think at times they should have, they should be looking to get on the ball more and play. I mean, the players with a lot of ability and. Uh, Players got a ability. You don't take it away from them. You got to encourage them and put it on the ball and, uh, and get it down and, and start to play. And hopefully that's what we can do. Uh, we've done a lot of shape tonight. Uh, we're working set pieces and whatever. So as I said, we'll uh, we'll progress that as we go along. And uh, you mentioned there you're going to be here until the end of the season. With you being out of the game now for a couple of years, did you get the fight about wanting to come back in the management? Well. Uh, uh, I'd retired, I'd never had no intentions of coming back. Um, as I said, I've been to a lot of, a lot of the games here and as I said, uh, when they asked me what I had them out, I was only, only too delighted to do that. So hopefully it'll, it'll prove a success. And you've had your first training session tonight, like you've touched on, it was just going over a wee bit of shape. Did you get to know a wee bit about, about the players and see how they act on the training pitch? Well, the training pitch, the live action is completely different. Yeah, you need to see them in a competitive situation. You know, the mentally strong ones or the ones that will stand up and be counted or whatever. So we'll assess that over the next few games. And you've got Bill Saturday, it's a tough game to, 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 to start with. Um, what, what, what's your thoughts then going, going into the Cliftonville game at the weekend? Well, they're all tough games in this league, there's no easy games. Uh, you're all fighting to get in the top six, this team's obviously fighting to win it. Um, this team's uh, at, at the bottom, so there's no easy games in football. You've just uh, got to go cliche, take each game as it comes and prepare properly and hopefully you can, you can get the result of Saturday. And has the board of Glenthorne mentioned to you what they want to, want to see from you? Is there any sort of objectives to see? No, no, see? No, 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 no objections whatsoever. Just come in, sort of steady the ship and give them a bit of breathing space for, uh, before they next, uh, the make their next appointment. And between now and the end of the season, we currently see ourselves in, in sixth position, following me although we have a few games in hand. With an Irish Cup game as well, uh, quarter final of the Irish Cup, you know, there's still a lot to play for this season. Well, there's still a lot to play for. I mean, ob obviously, if you look at our next five, five league games, uh, all ma all hard games against good sides. So there's no game easy in football. I, I've experienced that all my career. All my career, even playing teams in the lower leagues, there's no easy game. So I said we just got a ma mentally prepare on Saturday, and what I'm asking the players is to come off the pitch on Saturday. Uh, physically and mentally drained and that's what I have to do.